Well, I'm gonna go blow some snow right away so we can start moving grain again and so that semis can come and bring me more canola seed. But my cousin, he's busy pulling calves out. He started, uh, his beef cows started to calve already. So he's busy doing that and I just gotta wait for him to come and help me hook up the snowblower so I can get on my way. So I thought I'd just take you on a little tour of our equipment that we got sitting around here at the dairy farm. Look at it. This first piece is our swather. Isn't it nice? This is our air seeder. Anybody who's looking for a reliable seed seed cart through the Brigo line, don't get a 4350. I wouldn't wish it upon my worst enemy. <laughs> that being said, I have a 4350 Brigo tank if anyone wants to come and check it out. It's for sale. Oh, and this big thing back here is a dairy barn. It's about the size of Walmart, but they only sell dairy products. This is what I'm pushing snow with. Boom. So I thought I'd get away early and start blowing some of these yards out, but I am moving this auger down to the other yard because um, I actually thought Hayden was gonna do this, but he was, uh, he said he was covered head to toe in, uh, in cow afterbirth, so I figured he could use a little wash up. So this is one of our yards. Can you see that? There's canola in this one. Okay guys, this is pretty cool. So I've used a Fent in the past, but a Fent tractor in the past, but um, nothing, it's not, uh, it was nowhere near as spaceship-like as this one is. Look at this. It's got like a touchscreen shit here. Look at all these buttons. Look at them all. I f actually don't have to use my legs at all to drive this tractor. So just gotta click a button on the back of this uh, control or hand control here and then push forward. And I'm I'm not really sure. I'll figure it out right away, I guess. But I think the seat turns around. All this stuff turns around and the steering wheel also flips backwards from what I understand. We got this uh, reverse thing figured out. So as you can tell, that's the front of the tractor there. And that's the rear. Got the snow blower on it now. And we're going like 25 kilometers an hour backwards, but forwards, but backwards. I would say that the top end speed is slower. I just, we're going like 25 kilometers an hour and that's, I feel like the other fent that I've driven in the past, we got up to 30. So, I don't know. That sucks, I guess, but. Aiden phone me and asked if the DOT were sitting at the scales. I wonder what that means. I, f I feel like if anything, the most beneficial part of driving backwards, and I don't think I could have done this sitting the other way. Put my legs up. Man, this is the life. This is luxury. So this next yard is where we have most of our wheat sitting and it is 20 miles that way. Whoa! Almost went off the road. This is taking forever. I think I'm halfway. 
didn't get harvested this fall and it just got snowed on so he's gonna have to probably get out there this spring and get a combine and then do something with the residue it's gonna be wet as heck out there when you're trying to seed so hopefully it's a dry spring and an early spring and yeah hopefully it goes well for him but there's a lot of guys like that in our area just didn't get things off and it's too wet I can't believe we made it. Oh boy. going this fast the whole way here. When I came here, I was only going 25 and I, was, uh, I should have stopped and flipped the seat around. I just thought that that's as fast as it went. Holy shit, we're flying, boys. Be there in no time. Oh, I don't need any more of this tractor. It's hurting my back. Mm. It's not that bad. It's not that, it's not that bad. Oh. People are, people are dying to get in there. We're coming into Newdale. They sell fireworks and stuff. Oh, it looks like there's a bit of a lean on that one there. Oh, 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 oh. See you later, Newdale. Bye. Sun's going down, but I think I got time for one more yard. There's those bins over there. Look at the, look at the ice on the road. Good work today, guys. Solid, solid work all around. I'm tired, I can't even talk. Oh, well, just, I actually just looked at the radar and they're calling for like three feet of snow tomorrow, so. Nah, just kidding. Thanks guys for watching, come back for my next video, or else, don't forget to hit, sub don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like this video and comment because it's great to hear from you guys. Peace, 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 peace.